Today, I am testing a new tool called TextBuilder.ai. So I bought a subscription. They have various plans. I tried the, so the, these are the add-ons actually, not the initial plan. So I bought some plan with 300,000 credits. And now let's check how it works. So I can, uh, I can go on, uh, for example, on autopilot to uh, create some articles. So let's go to WordPress connect. What I want is to connect my WordPress blog, of course, because this text builder tool is able to automatically create articles for a blog. So I have to install a text builder plugin, blah, blah. Of course, there is a long YouTube video. Uh, so what it says, uh, okay, so I have to go to plugins and enter text builder. So let's go to my, uh, to my, oops, to my WordPress. And in my WordPress, I will find this uh, plugin here, plugins. Oh, I could go directly to add new plugin and I will find text builder. Okay. Text builder. Let's find it. Text builder. Here it is. Oops. So that is the plugin. I want to install it now. And then let's see how it works. Okay. It is installed. Now activate it and hopefully it will generate articles for my website. So now I have to connect to text builder. Let's do that. It will probably, I guess, ask for my uh, logins. No, it doesn't even add, ask for my, uh, my, uh, my credentials. Okay. So now that I have it, uh, what to do? What do they say? Click activate, click connect. Congratulations. And then, and then, and then uh, click on settings. Ah, so here I have to go on settings. I don't have settings, settings on top. Okay. Let's go to settings in, in settings, click on WordPress. And here on WordPress, I can add some blogs. So actually it already found one blog and theoretically we are supposed to be able to add more than one site. So I don't see uh, where it is here, but I have actually my blog added automatically. So I can sync categories. It has, so I guess it has found my categories and the tags on articles that have already uh, been posted on my website on this one. Uh, okay. So 464 tags. Nice. Then uh, now that it is synced, it will, uh, uh, and now how to post an article, go to auto writer. Uh, I guess this is the AI writer. Okay. Should be this one. Write a blog post. No, that's not the one. Uh, so where is the AI writer schedule article here? Maybe I can get articles, get ideas and schedule. Okay. Uh, so it is totally different than the uh, video. So let's put the video in full screen. Um, they have something totally different. Uh, so maybe, uh, oh, here, bug writer, one click content generation and content management tool. Okay. So I want to generate an article here. I, I can, I stop seeing this. No, I cannot. So here I can simply generate articles or oh, no, actually I have to find it myself. So here topic IDs, outline IDs, you are outlined, but me, I would like to get their IDs. So what do they say? Well, let's go back. If I go to topic IDs, it should uh, give me IDs for my, for my blog. Uh, so here I have only one blog. 
Okay, so it doesn't really give me IDs. Let's check for IDs. For example, IDs, what I do is uh, uh, digital uh, marketing, and let's just generate IDs. Okay, okay, okay. So here we have, oh, so here we have some IDs and directly we can use the out of writer to write this article. So for example, uh, and let's find something. Okay, let's just take the first one. Uh, Ultimate guide to digital marketing strategies for success. Let's click on auto writer. Ah, and now everything is filled in. So I can add context keywords if I want to. I can uh, um, use the automatic button to get keywords. Okay, so these keywords look good. Uh, now I have outlines. I can add modules. Okay, I don't know what's all that. Sounds all good. And now how to, I want to generate this article. Uh, okay. So generate, oh, so here I can select the type of article I want. So I have guide, I have how to, I have answer to question, benefits, list title, XIDs, top 10. So this article is the ultimate guide to digital marketing. So we want maybe a full article general. Okay. And we can generate. So this is, will be a long article, 1,600 to 3,000 plus words. And okay, we can generate. So now uh, the AI, artificial intelligence is generating the article. They say it should be a great article uh, with uh, eventually with illustration created uh, using um, maybe not DALI but another artificial intelligence that generates uh, generate illustrations. So usually I do it manually. So I write an article. If I don't find a good illustration, I take something on a stock picture. Uh, but now I don't like st stock pictures anymore because I am using artificial intelligence to generate some uh, more personalized thumbnails, thumbnails for my articles when I don't have one. Of course, if I if I have the inspiration to create one, I have some, my own, for example, screenshot or something, I will definitely use that. But in some cases, I don't have it. And lately, I am, I am experiment, experimenting with artificial intelligence to generate thumbnails for my articles. So let's see what's happening here. Uh, they say it takes five to 10 minutes, so that might be too long to, to wait. Uh, so they generate all paragraphs and articles. The status of, oh, so let's go to check the status of the task in the article list section. So here we go. They are at step zero from 15 to create a full article, a general article. Now, if I go to my blog and I go to my post, I will uh, probably see if something is happening. So here, uh, I have I have nothing. So uh, yeah, so I have nothing yet. These are actually articles that were created with another artificial intelligence uh, that I did not talk about yet. So here uh, it is in generation. How do I update? Let's reload the page and see if we get any update. So we get no update. Um, so as you saw when generating the article, I could not choose the length. I could actually not choose many things. And if I click on generate article, so it's the same, I cannot really choose much, but there are a lot of options. I can get IDs from URLs. I can outline IDs, get topic IDs. I can uh, create something based on an Amazon product. Uh, I can export some text created if I want, which can be very interesting if you don't use WordPress, which is my case for, uh, for many websites. And also I can on autopilot have a WordPress website uh, being fed with articles created by this uh, text builder, artificial intelligence. So all, all we have to do is uh, so start a project or connect WordPress. So I have already one WordPress and I don't know why I cannot add more. I should be, I should be able to, but here I can start a new project. 
I can enter my project title. So mine is, uh, uh, I want to actually do digital uh, marketing in a, on a specific uh, niche. So digital marketing in um, staff recruitment. So staff recruitment. My niche is, uh, oh, they have tons of niche. So my niche, my niche, my niche. It will probably be about entrepreneurship and business. I want to target actually HR responsible that are interested in available resources to work in uh, manual uh, manual activities. So I have these workers available. Um, so I'm not sure where it should be, but probably probably still entrepreneurship and business. For sure, it's not recreational. So and it's that I can choose my WordPress blog. I can create project and now I can uh, put on autopilot to uh, generate generate uh, titles for me. Uh, write a list of the ten shows. Uh, uh, short blog topic ideas about uh, about uh, available available. Um, Workers, so actually, we have welders available uh, in uh, in a French speaking area. In French speaking area, and actually, I want them to be created in French. So I don't know if that's oh yes, output language. So I can choose French. So on autopilot, I could uh, I could have French outputs. So here, let's see if we can get uh, topic IDs. We can also generate feature images, images in articles. We can choose the photo style. This is very interesting. Oh, here we go. Uh, here we have uh, so a lot of topic IDs, so that, that's good. Um, so you can do it in the language you want, on the topic you want. You can choose the article length, or here we can choose article length, short, middle, or long, the point of view, the tone, if we want a different tone. Uh, we can choose if we want some bold italic inside if we want an FAQ usually I like to have an FAQ because an FAQ so questions and answer it's easy to update so when you want to update your articles just add one question and answer and you uh, you quickly um, update one uh, one blog article key takeaways okay we can add AI images we can have one image in article body okay photo style Generate and add photos with text overlay. So, oh, as you can see, generated these, generating these titles has taken away some credits. Okay, we can add photo uh, with text overlay. I don't know, and external links to a related websites. So we can add automatically the links to other websites. So that's very very simple. And all we have to do then is to press uh, start. So I don't really want um, 10 articles now. This is just to uh, try one. And uh, yeah, so it's just to try. Now let's just see what we have currently going. Uh, so we go, where we go? Where can we see our, uh, our current queue? Voila, the interface is not so easy. So let's go back. Uh, Let's go back. Where did I have my current queue of articles being generated? Here. So I uh, auto writer generation. So I don't know how to how to get to this screen, but here I am. So ten minutes uh, ten minutes later. We are still at step zero from 15, so I don't know how long it will uh, it will take. I'm very curious about what will be the result of such article, especially now I am uh, very curious uh, why I cannot add here another another website, but I will uh, get in touch with them and update. Uh, create a, no, another video once I will have an article generated. But in any case, uh, textbuilder.ai. So you can uh, just uh, join their website and uh, check it out. It sounds, uh, it seems pretty nice, at least on the paper. Uh, but I don't know yet about the results. We will see soon. And if you uh, if you uh, if you follow what I'm doing, you will you will see how it goes.
So good luck with your article generation.